It's battle box time. This one is mission 73 and we're going to take a look and see what is in this box coming up next here on Survival on Purpose. Welcome back to Survival on Purpose, your home for trustworthy information and gear reviews related to camping, survival, and general preparedness for regular folks. My name is Brian. Thanks for joining me. So the folks at BattleBox were kind enough to send me every month now for the last several years one of their BattleBox subscription boxes. If you're not familiar with BattleBox, they are a monthly subscription box, mystery box, and they're actually related to camping, survival, and general preparedness. So they're a good fit for the channel. And... They have four different subscription levels at every level. You pay a little more money and you get a little more stuff. I make these videos just to show you what's in there so you can kind of, we have a library that you can refer to. You can kind of make a decision of whether or not you think it's something you might be interested in exploring further. If you are interested in exploring further, you can save 10% on your first box by using the coupon code in the video description below. Anyway, without further ado, let's take a look and see what is in this month's battle box, Mission 73. So first of all, like every battle box, there's a little mission brief here that shows you what's in the box at each different level. And we're just going to start right off the front with um, the basic level is the first level. And let's see what's in the basic level. So the first item in the basic level is some salty britches chafing ointment. So <laughs> there's been plenty of times I could have used some of that. So um, basically it's, uh, it's exactly what it says. It is to, uh, it's kind of a skin barrier ointment to prevent or soothe chafing and blisters during rup and ruck amphibious, amphibious operations and all other imagined misery. I like that. So, and it's twelve ninety five for a, uh, two, two fluid ounce, um, tube. So that, that seems like a pretty handy thing to have. I can tell you there's been plenty of times I would love to have some of this. The next item is pretty cool because, um, I'm actually wearing one myself right now already. And this is the, uh, paracord brace that my son made me years ago but but right below it you can see i've got this little elastic band on here and what it is it is the uh they're calling this the gtfo wrist strap with advanced handcuff key and it's just a little um i'm gonna take mine off and show you so i don't have to because uh, it comes in a little paper it's in this little little paper thing here and i think this was in a crate club but it's really pretty cool it's just a little elastic band it's got a carbide bead on it, so if you were in your car and you need to break a window, you get, get to the corner where there's no room for it to flex, and you can pop this thing back and pow, and you have a good chance of breaking the window because that's what you really need. You need a small, a small area of force right up against the corner of a window where there's no flex for it, and it can shatter it. But this one also has a handcuff key on it too as well, which is pretty cool. So I just keep that on my wrist at all times because what the heck, it doesn't weigh anything, and it's easy you never know when you might need it come in handy so there's that and the price on this one is $19.99 it's a tungsten striker bead i'm sorry i said it was carbide but it's tungsten the next item is a culture co cipher bandana and that's pretty interesting so this has got nato phonetic words morse code sign language and semaphore all represented on this bandana which is by the way 100 percent american made and it's based printed with soft water based inks that will hold their color under the roughest treatment so, let's see, it's 100% cotton made in the USA. Let's have a look at this thing. It's pretty stinking cool, I think. So, if you ever need to know the phonetic alphabet, uh, and what that means is, if instead of saying letters like, hey, if you're looking for a tag, say, it's, you know, G7, G, G, K, V, then that's actually going to be Golf, Kilo, Victor, I believe it's Victor. Um, yeah, and the reason that's because it's, it's really easy to maybe mis misunderstand V for a B or a D if you're talking over radio, especially with, with bad communication. But, but Victor is pretty, pretty simple. So once you know that, it's really easy to take that out um, and, and take, to extrapolate that from a conversation. It tells you how to use a signal mirror. It's got some sign language. It's got Morse code on it. Um, pretty stinking cool. So it's a nice reference, and it's a good bandana. All cotton made in the USA. So um, I like this. I like this a lot, actually. Um, there's one more item in the basic box, and it's also pretty stinking cool. It's rapid rope. And as a Boy Scout, you know I like me some rope and some knots. And all this is is a um, 120 feet of extreme utility rope ready to go. It's flat braided nylon, weight rated at a whopping 1,100 pounds. And you pull it out, and it's got a built-in safety blade to cut it. So the safety blade's right up in there. You just pull out what you need, cut it off, and you're good to go. By the way, look right there what it says. You like that? I like it. Made in the USA. So be something great just to keep in your truck or whatever. If you need some rope to tie something down or whatever, just pull it out and you're good to go. 
and this has a $25 value, $24.95. So, uh, pretty cool, I think. Pretty handy idea. Some one of those things I wish I had thought of. So that's the basic box. I'm, I'm going to try to do a breakdown on the price in here. Twelve. We'll, we're going to call the 95s. We're going to round them up. So, 13 bucks and 20 bucks is 33 bucks. Plus 14 bucks is 47 bucks. Plus 25 bucks is 72 bucks. They like that quick math on video. <laughs> the next level of box is the advanced box. And the advanced box, you get everything in the, in the pre previous level, plus some more stuff. This month, there's some more stuff is a couple of things. First, it is a tried and true Stanley travel mug. And Stanley has a reputation for, for going back de literally decades on thermos type products. And this is a thermos mug, like so, double wall stainless. And then it has a uh, little push button here to open it up drink out of it so you don't spill it on you and i think that's pretty cool keep stuff hot for a long time and <laughs> it says on here stanley bottles that survives a minus 70 degree wind chill four thousand foot drops speeding bullets and category five hurricanes so and it keeps stuff hot for nine hours 12 hours cold or 40 hours iced so i wonder if it keeps the coffee that you get at like um dunkin donuts um if, if it maintains that thousand degree coffee temperature for, for nine hours because I don't understand why they make it that hot because here's the problem with the Dunkin Donuts this is a little bit of a ramble I like I like their coffee and I like their donuts but the problem is by the time my coffee's cool enough to drink it I've already eaten the donut it's a life struggle I tell you so anyway <laughs> that's the travel mug <coughs> from Stanley which is one thing pretty cool and they're giving that one a $25 value and there's also a little Smith & Wesson Extreme Ops folder I don't know if I reviewed this one or not. Uh, Smith & Wesson is made by the same people that make Shrade. Uh, this one's from Taylor Brand. So this, this is from 2010. So that, somebody might have had this one in stock for a while because Taylor Brands sold to a division of Smith & Wesson sometime about uh, two or three years ago. So, But this is a, just a really cool, nice little folding knife. It's not expensive. It's like $12.99, so 13 bucks. So we were at 72 plus 13 is going to make it 85 <laughs> right plus 25 is going to make it 105 bucks value on the advanced box so the next level is the pro box and the pro box again everything before plus some more stuff and <clears throat> i gotta say this month the more stuff is pretty stinking cool it is a vortex optics solo monocular and it is um what's the uh eight by 25 and i gotta admit i think this is pretty cool because one of the issues I have with binoculars is I can never seem to get the two eyeballs focusing right. And it's probably because of my vision. I have some, I have some, I'm wearing corrective lenses now, but it's, um, I never can quite get it to focus right. With, with a monocular, a monocular instead of a binocular, then that issue is not, it's not an issue. It's not existent. And you just look through it like so and, and bam, look at that. Would you look at that? So pretty cool there. Nice handy little thing to have. Just keep it in your um, in your vehicle or whatever. If you need, you need to close up on something, you can definitely get it. And it comes with a nice little case here and, and a little, little lanyard. So, And they're giving this one a $75 value. I lost my count. So that makes it, uh, we're 85 and 25 is 110 plus 75 is 185 bucks. So that's the pro level. Finally, there's one more level and it, and that's the pro plus level or sometimes called the knife of the month club and at that level you get everything in the previous levels plus some more stuff usually some sort of bladed implement and this month is no exception this bladed implement is the revolt rotor revolt so is, is saying revolt kind of like saying police <laughs> i don't know is it revolt or revolt i don't know let me open this thing up because uh Sometimes I have been known to say police. <laughs> you know, like the high sheriff and the police are coming after me. Remember that song? So, that's a pretty interesting little knife. It's got a really strange little locking system. Okay, so let me just show you how this thing works. You see that bar right there? I got trying to keep this thing in focus. It's got a little bar right there on the back. And the back is kind of under tension. It's, it's going to lock down into that notch. Bam, and that locks. And, oh, the problem with that is... If you peel up on this, it unlocks. So when you're squeezing like this and using it, it's going to stay locked better. And it's got a little jimping here. Um, 
pretty neat it's got a little lanyard hole here and then to uh, open to close it you're just gonna pull up on that just a little bit and it closes and it actually opens up too I didn't think it was gonna flick open because it doesn't have a lot of click on it because there's not much noise there but there you go so that's the revolt rotor and that's BattleBox Mission 73, um, the, the Pro Plus level. <coughs> so we were at 185, were we? We were at 185. This thing has a $90 value. That brings it to 275. So not bad. I think the price, I don't know what the price is. You can check it on BattleBox, but you, know, you can save 10% on your first box by using the coupon code. I think it's served 10, but I'll put it right here and put it in the video description below. So, so anyway, thanks again to the folks at BattleBox for sending me these boxes every single month for the last several years. So we can kind of build up this reference library so you can check them out and get examples of what you might could expect if you decide to explore this further. And as always, thank you for watching Survival on Purpose. I put out a brand new video every Friday and Saturday, sometimes random videos throughout the week. I really appreciate the support. Once again, my name's Brian. You're watching Survival on Purpose. Remember, survival's not an accident, so be prepared. I'll see you next time.